like that. Hit his area with 51. Everything in the butterflies. Go get your man. And I feel like butterfly gonna be captain. So all y'all wanna know what happened. I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got smoked. Get away with it. <laughs> oh man, oh man. You already know what it is, man. Salute to the subscribers, that notification game, etc. etc. Don't let that, that get too far ahead of you. You know who I be. Follow me on IG. Vada underscore fly, tell your mama I said hi, salute to the subscribers, you know what I'm saying? Because without y'all, all 80,000 of y'all, where would we be? Now, I got a lot of things to unpack today. I hope, just please, I don't ever ask y'all to spend a little time, you know what I'm saying? Like, just watch this video in its entirety. I'm going to talk about the things y'all want me to talk about because I've been seeing, I've been hearing what's going on out here, and one word to describe it is nasty work. Now, I didn't make the term up, but I get credited a lot for being like one of the first ones to really like push that term in battle rap. Nasty work is what's going on. Nasty work by nasty workers. This is the original Rice Gang hoodie. If y'all want me to bring just this one back, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm, I'm gonna fuck around and bring just this one to start it off. I know y'all been asking about the clothes for a minute, but I just feel like by the fly, gonna recap this now. Nah, but I've been busy. I've been having a lot going on and all of that. Back when I was really pushing it and doing it, I had time every day to go to the post office, do this, that, and the third. I'm gonna hire some folks and get shit done because, uh, you know what I'm saying? I don't be having time. But, uh, man, where do we start? Uh, let's start here. Oh, uh, the bootleg. Bootleg, bootleg, bootleg. Got this Chinese chick, had to leave her quick, cause she kept bootlegging my. Bootleg, bootleg. Well, well, well. I got that too for you. Uh, you guys, bootleg, compromised media. Um, I really don't do a lot of blogs and I don't really talk about media in my blogs like this, but yo, y'all niggas is wildin'. Pat Stay event? Bro, really? Yeah. Why? Why not? A watch, first of all, a watch party and a bootleg is the same damn thing. As media, like as a blogger, we get bootlegs. I probably have bootlegs in this phone right here. This is my phone. I probably have bootlegs that have been sent to me. They send them all the time. I might watch them. Just watch it with SP a little bit. Because the only way we can get like the footage that we use from app battles. Bootlegs. People send bootlegs. People share bootlegs. It happens all the time. Y'all niggas had a flyer for a bootleg for a watch party. <laughs> Baby, welcome to the party. I think a flyer. Don't be mad. Like, stand on your hustle. Hey, Cola, stand on your hustle. And you know, whenever it came to me or other bloggers, y'all be so quick to talk about us. So don't get mad. Do not get mad. As a matter of fact, I don't even give a fuck you get mad. But it's your turn. This is your turn. Hey, man, you know what I'm saying? It's your turn. You hustle. You got to get yours. You a hustler, baby. You are a hustler. A stone cold hustler. This man so, I and mind you. We got all the screenshots. They sent all the screenshots to every single blogger. If you think I'm lying, I'm, I'm flying. Because I don't got time. I don't be having time to be checking after y'all and seeing who's doing what and all of that. I know y'all be feeling like y'all bigger than the battle rappers, and I'm going to talk about that in one second, too. Y'all not bigger than no battle rappers. Ain't nobody bigger than the system, bro. I understand we here. I understand we get clout. I understand we got viewers, subscribers. People watch us, people tune into us. You got the angry fans, you got the Piper Boys, you got the fuck, the Chris Unbiases of the world, the Jay Blacks, the, 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 the Gems, everybody. These all the people are doing their thing, doing their numbers, pushing their platform. Trust me, when they wake up and do a blog, they not worried about, yo, what's gonna happen in spaces today? This might blow me out the water. Oh my goodness, they recap is gonna blow. They, I promise you they not worried about it. I promise you, y'all be feeling like y'all so, so, so big, bro. This is just battle rap media, we talk about Battles and battle rap, but you be feeling like you bigger than the battle rappers. I heard you niggas, oh, I'm bigger than the big tier. Oh, I'm bigger than, nigga, you ain't bigger than no fucking body. I don't care what nobody tell you. None of you battle rapper niggas say something to me. I'm too, I'm serious too. I'm talking to him and you niggas be sensitive and I'm saying the truth. Leave me alone. I like most of y'all. I don't care what these niggas tell you. They be gassing you niggas up and that's a bad part about it. 
they be gassing you up. And Tony Bro, you should have grabbed this nigga by the collar and put him down a long time ago. You think I would let SP jump on the camera on any way to say he's bigger than a battle rapper? Do you think I would let this nigga jump on camera saying he's bigger than a battle rapper? You niggas is crazy. And you let this shit go on. That's y'all house. Whatever happens in y'all house, that's all of y'all. I got SP with me. If SP do some dumb shit, I gotta wear it. Y'all talking about, oh, we don't know. Oh, we don't know. It was a bootleg. Nigga, you niggas knew. I see right here. What we doing? Ain't trying to be putting niggas in at the last minute. $5 donation. Ain't that Geechee event? Ain't that Geechee event? I don't feel like editing for you niggas. You niggas, I'm not editing for this. I'm going to just say it straight up. Ain't this Geechee's event? Yes or no? This is Geechee's event. Los Angeles, the riot. You niggas had a streaming party, a.k.a. a bootleg. Don't lie about them seats from the pay-per-view. They sent all of the media the screenshots. We have them. Why are you guys caping? Why are you lying about it? I don't understand. Remy, anniversary car. Oh, Remy, I got Oh, no, no, no. Remy, we going on Fox News tomorrow, myself and some others. I brought Remy and I brought Easy with me because uh, we got to have this conversation. You know what I'm saying? I'll never be cutting on my camera, talking about you niggas and all of that, but y'all love to talk about us. Y'all love to throw us under the bus. So, eh, eh, nigga, the bus goes over you. I got a box in the mail, right? Got a box. Oh, shit. Box in the mail. Oh, it's a coat. Hold on, it's a coat. It's a coat. It's a coat. Oh, shit. Salute to Chrome 23, right? Got my little logo on here. You know what I'm saying? I'm bringing it around here for y'all. Y'all can see. Shout out to Chrome 20. Can you see that on there? Can you see it on there? Don't you even worry about it. Uh, this is a nice jacket from uh, Chrome 23. And there's a card in here. And I'm going to tell y'all what the card says. Salute to Remy and thank you for that. It says thanks. It says, uh, loves the support, the bad critiques, the good criticism. All truly appreciated, Remy Ma, Chrome 23, right? And I say that because I don't have to kiss nobody's ass. I don't have to fucking, you know what I'm saying, pretend some shit is good when it's not. I don't have to fucking, what Chris and Byers say, I don't have to meat ride none of these niggas. I could tell them when the event was good. I could tell them when the event was bad. And I don't have to bootleg it. See, and this is a fire code, by the way. I got my area codes and all of that shit on there. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And still uncompromised because uh, if Remy have a bad event, we'll still burn it down. I'll burn it down with the code on. I'll burn it down with the code on. But, yeah, let's get back to it. So, y'all had watch parties for Chrome 23? Y'all niggas was there. How are you there and still have a watch party for it? These niggas got employees. Niggas must got a staff. They got, you know how, like, when you call... When you, call, when you call like Google Chrome or like MacBook support, it sends you to somebody in like Italy, I mean like India. Hello, may I help you today with your... Niggas got, they got a staff. This nigga was at the event and still bootlegged it. You a different nigga. I'm not even mad at you though. You a different nigga. I never seen no shit like that before. You bootlegged the event that you was at and y'all be talking about us? I wish, talk about me, go ahead. We can do this as long as you want. I don't care what you feel like anybody did. Y'all did this shit the last two, three years. Taking money out of people's pocket. A watch party for Pat Stay? Bro, we bought the event. I bought the event, couldn't even, didn't even have time to watch it. I didn't watch it till way later I bought it. It's about the support. They raised 250000 And here you go, Frank Lucas, under the table. <laughs> Niggas is doing under the table deals. Why is people selling pay-per-views for $45, $55 and y'all niggas got them for 10 Got him for five. And it's not about the bootleg, because everybody keeps saying bootleg, bootleg, bootleg. It's not about that. People see bootlegs all the time, but people don't sell bootlegs. You niggas did it. The screenshots are all here. They're all here. We got them all like we seen them. Donation room almost full. Donate to bootlegtivity. The donation room. Oh, you did it, my nigga. You did it. Just admit it. You're going to be fine. Niggas going to grind you up. Nobody don't want you out of battle rap, but niggas, stop bootlegging niggas' events. You bootleg John John shit. Then you had to pay him. Niggas had to pay Pat Stay. You niggas gonna be paying everybody. Shit, like, <laughs> y'all gotta pay everybody. <laughs> and I'm not even bad. 
I swear to God, I'm not even mad. I'm gonna get my money off of it too. I might as well. You niggas get your money off talking about other people. I might as well get some money off of you. Matter of fact, I should throw my cash app up here. That's what y'all say. Hit the cash app. Hit the ca I don't never say that. Niggas don't never see me on no shit, but I'll do it today. I'll put my Send me some money. Send me some money for lunch. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Like, well, what's the deal? So, anyway, let's go further, right? So. Remy has y'all at the event, she has the nigga judging the event, you nigga still bootleg this shit? Y'all some dirty workers, I'm not gonna hold you. And it ain't everybody, I know it's not the whole team. You know I don't even be knowing everybody and shit like that, cause you know what I'm saying, I really do not genuinely be paying attention, I just do what I do and keep it moving. But, I heard niggas was sending me clips and shit, like when the cola nigga be talking about me and shit, and I never talk about this nigga, I don't even know this nigga, I never seen this nigga a day in my life, but he got so much to say about so many people. You bootleg Remy shit? Pat Stay shit too? Like, I had a watch party for Pat State that you jumped up there and said you didn't do it. No, we didn't do it. We didn't do it. This is my first time. This is my first time. Nigga, it don't look like the first time to me. Because I see the fucking flyer. Niggas make <laughs> Yo, y'all made a... <laughs> Baby, welcome to the party. Y'all niggas made a flyer for a bootleg, bro. Where's them bootlegs? Who got the Arpola? That's you, right? Who got the RBE bootlegs? Who got the King of the Dot bootlegs? Who got the bootleg? Bro, y'all niggas would might get a speeding ticket the way y'all was speeding rushing to get these bootlegs, bro. What's up with y'all niggas, man? You know what y'all niggas need? Need a wig. You need a job. Y'all niggas need a job. Y'all niggas need to go get some jobs. See me? That's why I don't be really having time to blog all the time. When I just talk, bro, I don't even be having time to push my clothes and shit because I got to work. You know why? Because Battle Rap Media is called supplemental income. Like whatever I make from work or whatever I make from being here or there, the Battle Rap shit is just a supplement. Like if I make a couple dollars, I give SP something, yada, yada, yada. But this is not a job, my nigga. You niggas need jobs. Can't be in I always knew that shit. When I heard niggas be in spaces for five, six, seven, eight hours a day, I said niggas is not working. Well, niggas is not working. You need to go get a job, my nigga. This shit could be supplemental. I'm just giving you advice. You think this is your main job? You was charging niggas for a reply? Just to boy, say why no you do like John John shit? Boy, ain't no way. Nigga, you bro. crazy. Um, boy, so no yeah, way, like, like, I see, like I said, they were sending all the media, all the screenshots. Y'all niggas bootlegged the MC War shit. Reserve your spot. The battles on the beats? Why y'all bootlegging that? Like I said, y'all niggas had a f <laughs> Y'all had a lip and so Look at this shit. Look at this. Nah, y'all getting all this work. Look at this shit, y'all. These niggas had a fucking flyer. Focus on the flyer. A flyer for ARP shit. Y'all had a flyer and a Black Compass Media watch party? Who did this if it wasn't y'all? And you said it was your first event. All we asking for is you to stop lying. If you did it, say you did it. Say I did it and I'm gonna bootleg the next shit too. Fuck it. What is niggas gonna do to you? Are they gonna beat you up? They gonna, you know what I'm saying? Like, just stand on it. Y'all had parties. Nobody knew. Y'all niggas was packing out rooms. They said, get your spot now. We running out of room. Baby, welcome to the party. Y'all niggas was running out of room at the party. They was running out of room at the party. And y'all see, the thing is, this is what y'all do. You know what I'm saying? Y'all disguise it as a donation. We not charging, but you gotta give a donation to get in. That Pat Stay shit, nasty work. ARP shit, nasty work. Y'all niggas is bootlegging everybody's events. Remy shit, nasty work. Geechee shit, nasty work. You said you did it one time. Did all of these events happen on the same day? Stop lying, and everybody that was involved knew something about it. SP can't be running no fucking bootleg liquor stand, and I don't know nothing about it. He could not, like how, how? I don't do Discord, I don't do Spaces, I don't do any of that shit. But I find it very hard to believe that niggas didn't know. Then y'all gotta give money to Pat Stay. Y'all gotta pay Pat Stay's estate. You gotta pay John John. Niggas. <laughs> y'all some funny niggas. But stop acting like you bigger than battle rappers because you're not bigger. None of y'all are bigger than no battle rappers. I'm not even bigger than no battle rapper. I don't give a shit if it's a low tier, crucible tier, little, little, little tier, never been heard of tier. You niggas are not bigger than no battle rappers. I don't give a fuck who tells you that. And I don't care if Debo tell you that. If Debo gonna help, gonna help you crash out. See, the thing is, I fuck with Debo. You know what I'm saying? But... Debo really, his res the respect on what he does is not really that high right now. Queen of the Ring ain't got no motion. He be doing a little media shit. Niggas be seeing him on stage, take two steps back, two steps back. We always gonna respect what he did, 
But if that's the sword you're going to fall on and the advice that you're going to take, you're going to crash out every time. I'm sorry. You're going to crash out every time. And don't get mad. It's a hundred niggas making blogs about it. I'm going to get mine too. You know what I'm saying? It, it ain't no fun when the rabbit got the gun, nigga. I got to get paid. I'm going to hustle. I'm going to hustle. I'm going to hustle. That's what you said, right? I got to get paid too, nigga. I'm getting paid off you. We're going to get paid off you today. Thank you. Lunch on you. Might even get some soda with it. Lunch is on you, my nigga. Um, so yeah, bootleg compromise. Stop bootlegging, nigga shit. Past day shit, nasty work. I don't give a fuck how you try to dress it up. I don't give a fuck how you try to make it seem. You niggas had a watch party for an event of a man who passed away. For that, you niggas is trifling. Now let's move on to the next subject. Um, caffeine. Didn't I tell y'all about the caffeine shit? Caffeine tried to sign me not once, but twice. I turned caffeine down both times. I said I wasn't interested in it. All the artists made it seem like this is the new wave, this is the way things is going. Well, Goods just said on his show. There's a lot of stuff changing on here. Starting in May, you know what I'm saying? Um, you are not going to see a lot of people on caffeine. Um, the people you do see on caffeine is people that I guess they felt was via, valuable, I can't even say that word, so don't, you know what I'm trying to say, to the company, I can't say the word, I, we know the word, I can't say it, or that, that was doing a thing, or, you know what I'm saying, um, or whatever, you know what I'm saying, um, I don't know who it's gonna be, I don't know what's going on, but starting May 1st, you're not going to see everybody on caffeine. It's only going to be maybe three people. Okay? All right. I mean, I mess with caffeine, man. I love caffeine. We're talking about the night. So check it, man. That Goods just stated the fact that uh, caffeine going away. All besides maybe three channels. Everything else is going away. So all you niggas that be sitting up there gaming, streaming, gave them all them hours, shit is going away. Caffeine's like, nigga, we out. They don't see what y'all bringing in as lucrative. If y'all was doing major numbers or the numbers that y'all thought y'all was doing or if y'all was doing big things, they wouldn't be pushing you out the door. Ain't no company pushing people that's doing big things out the door. I'm going to tell you like that. If you're doing big things and your shit is booming, nobody's pushing you out the door. But the numbers is inflated. They don't be real. They just be saying niggas be doing all these views. They don't be doing. I don't know. Nobody that really be watching caffeine except for maybe a couple people here and there. And now you niggas got to go. Caffeine's like, oh, they looked at the numbers. They said, wait, wait, whoa, 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 wait, 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 wait. This ain't adding up. We got to hold a board meeting. And in that board meeting, they basically let niggas know, yo, show is over. Y'all niggas got to go. It is what it is. So all these battle raps and we getting all this money, we doing, if y'all getting all this money and doing all these big power moves and shit on caffeine, why are they kicking y'all out? It's like 50 to 100 of y'all that's all going to lose jobs. Indeed.com, y'all niggas need to go get jobs. It's basically what they're saying. YouTube's popping. I've been told y'all YouTube was popping. YouTube's a lucrative business and YouTube can't fire you. They're not going to fire you. They love the shit that we bringing in. The numbers that we be bringing in, numbers, numbers, because y'all be quick to be on the numbers, numbers, numbers shit. We ain't even gonna do that. We don't, y'all niggas don't wanna do that. But imagine if I would've had the 35, 40 million views that I have on this channel and put them on caffeine, then they're kicking me out the whip. They're kicking you niggas out the whip. Shoulda not listened to begin with. Uh, best of luck to y'all. I think with that, uh, if caffeine's doing budget cuts, they're gonna cut a lot of the artists and then they, and then you, them and URLs are gonna go separate ways. Because I, I never understood how did they make money off of caffeine anyway. That prop, prop, prop shit, that shit ain't no money. Ain't no money. Ain't no money. <laughs> ain't no money. That's why you see niggas running around bootlegging every fucking event. And the thing is, you know, I, I want the artists to do good, but it is what it is, you know? So I'ma just leave it there to keep it fair. Uh, shout out to all of my subscribers. Shout out to uh, Remy. You know what I'm saying? I, you can be sure I would never uh, bootleg none of your events. You know what I'm saying? And she do. She know about this already too. She already know. So yeah, I'm just letting y'all know. She know. So you know, she wasn't too happy about it either. ARP wasn't happy about it. Geechee Gotti wasn't happy about it. John John and Don wasn't happy about it. Uh, Organic wasn't happy about it. You niggas ran the table. Y'all ran the table. Y'all niggas had a bootleg operation. And then when it's time to defend it, you say it's the first time you did it. It don't, it must be two first. It must be two 
first. If this is the first time you did it, it must be two first. The best thing you can do right now is shut the fuck up, let the events happen, and keep it moving. I ain't saying niggas don't want you around, niggas don't want y'all to do battle rap, but y'all gotta bring it down a little bit. That whole attitude like you're bigger than the battle rappers and all that, this shit is never gonna work. So I'm bigger than mid tier, mid tier, low tier. What? Nigga, what? We've been doing this shit five, six, seven, eight years. We don't carry that energy. I would never, ever, ever. I'm bigger than a battler. Nigga, you don't do nothing but talk about battles, and that's for everybody. How? We don't rap. What kind of shit is here? I'd be blessed to get a check and be able to pay people and pay SP and things like that by just talking shit about battle rap. You know how many people would love to do that? I niggas got a little bit too much ego, a little too cocky and shit, and that shit is, you see where it got you. Y'all got to wear it, because the thing is, that bootleg shit, that shit is not coming off. I don't care how you try to paint it, how y'all try to spin it, niggas is gonna be on that shit, because niggas love bootlegs. Shit, I love bootlegs. That uh, Javante fight is coming up this weekend. Well, one of my partners is copying it, so I might, you know, slide by there. But if I wasn't sliding by there and bringing, you know what I'm saying, a little bit of the good and probably order some pizza, yada, yada, yada. If I wasn't sliding by there, Javante would be getting slid on. What? StreamEast.com. It's a lot of websites. Go to Stream East and go to other places that we watch. We love bootlegs, but we don't love selling bootlegs. You cannot do it. You can't undercut the system. These niggas is packaging their shit for $45. Y'all repackaging it for $10, $5. These niggas crazy. Man, whatever. And y'all be trying to deflect by talking about other people and this person did that in 2012 and that person did that in 2000. Don't deflect. Don't deflect. Wear it. This is yours. You a hustler. You a hustler, my nigga. That's what you do. You get money, right? You get money, right? Go find them niggas uptown, B. Go uptown, find them niggas, B. Go find that man, and don't come back till you find that man. <laughs> y'all do great things for battle rap as a team, you know what I'm saying? It's no slide on or black comments, you know what I'm saying? Y'all niggas do great things for the community. But if you think I'm not getting paid off this shit, I'm going to get paid too. You know what I'm saying? We all got to get paid. I ain't going to talk about this again, but I'm going to talk about it today. Y'all niggas have a great day. I'm out of here. Got this Chinese chick, had to leave her quick, because she kept bootlegging my...